Hey guys, it's Lox Effect here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to do a um gun muzzle flash. Uh, so yeah, I'll just show you a sample of what I made. Probably can't see it properly, but yeah. okay. So what I've done for you is has uh, uploaded on the internet. It's put it in the thumb right now. Uh, a zip file. It's called Lox Effect. That will be in the link in the description below. So you want to unzip it once you've downloaded it, and you get a file called Lox Effect. You want to open it. It's got all the stuff you need. So and you want to read this. It says, hey guys, all the editing essentials you need is in here and everything like that. So here's the muzzle flash of the gun shots, green screen, and this is my, uh, my one of mine I made. Okay, so you want to open that up. And you want to download it Live Quartz and iMovie HD. So I've downloaded Live Movie HD. you want to open up a new one, I think it's free. Okay, so create a new project. Okay. Okay, so HD. Put it on DV. Okay, now you go on photo booth or your camera or whatever you're using. Okay, so obviously it will look more real with the um Obviously, it'd look more real with a real gun. Oh yeah, so uh, you got to drag it into here. Now just click off of that. Put that other way. Now I just want to drag it there. Now you want to play it and get to the point where it's about to shoot, or if it's midway into shooting. I like midway; it makes it look a bit more realistic. So look there; it's all blurry. Now you want to press Command T. That cuts it. Now don't do anything. Uh, you do Save Frame. Do it onto your desktop. Make sure it's JPEG. You want to get off of that. Go into Live Court. Not quite sure what it's called. Uh, the link will be in the manual in the file I gave you. So now you want to drag this into here. Wait, whoops, sorry. There we go. Now, you, so this is the one I just did. You want to drag that in. Now you want to drag the muzzle flash. You can choose any one of these. And if none of these are to your liking, you can just type in on Google Images. Now you need live quartz, not, um, no other uh, video, not many video editing software from Mac actually does this. Uh, you want to click on the rubber, like getting cut through by scissors, and just do that, and it takes away the black. Okay, so now you just want to move it to where it should go, and then you want to change the rotation. Okay, now just move it to where it should be. Spit, muck around with it a little bit. Alpha makes it fluorescent, but you don't. I mean, not fluorescent. It makes it um, see-through, transparent. That's the word. Okay, so you want to do save as. Now this is crucial, or it won't work. You want to change the format to JPEG. Quality, the highest it can go. And save. Saved it. So where did that save? 
Love you. Wow, I'll just check that. Okay. So now you want to go back onto a new BHD. Oh, sorry about that. Um, my computer, for some reason, just stopped recording. But it's all good. Turn the exact same spot. Now you just want to drag this straight in there. And then see how that got there? You want to put it into a mat. So perfect. Now look, when you play it, it does that, and you don't want that, for sure, making the stupidest film in the world. Now you just want to do that. Okay, so now you go to editing, oh no, not editing, sorry, media, photos, and you just go show photo setting. You just want to bring it all the way to the back, and then update. See, so you now that's instant. And now you want to go into that file I um, gave you and you want to look for a gunshot. You just want to drag that in. And where this bit is, you just want to drag the start of it over. Okay, so now you just want to go to share. Full quality. And then press share. Yeah. Okay, so just you I, um so yeah I've just been brushing so yes okay it's this now nah, it might not come out good on this because uh, yeah I use my webcam okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that was pretty good. Okay, so remember to subscribe and comment. Uh, that would be very helpful. And if you have any problems, just send me a message or tell me in the comments below. Okay, so bye.